And now to an ATM heist that you have to see to believe. Thieves determined to take the cash they didn't just break into a machine in front of a building in Queens. They ripped the ATM right out of the wall. The whole thing was caught on video. CBS 2's Dave Carlin in Long Island City tonight. Dave. Maurice and Christine, we have seen people come here and take photos of this. This is where an ATM used to be, so something is missing. It was here last night, but this morning, just before sunrise, thieves took it. Gone in 60 seconds, ATM thieves used a chain and a van to yank it out of concrete and metal reinforcements around 6.30 Wednesday morning. The not subtle suspects are a driver you don't see on the video and this man in a hoodie who carried off this heist with speed. You can see him in this cell phone video from an across the street neighbor on 35th Avenue. He didn't go on camera, but his friend did. He saw everything, called the police, and the police showed up fairly quickly, but... Uh, they pretty much passed each other. Oh, you think that the suspects and the no, cops no, no. must have they, passed each they, other? They, they missed each other by like 30 seconds. Here again is that money shot moment in a second angle from a fixed surveillance camera system down the street from the stolen ATM, which belonged to Showroom Auto. With the machine dragged out into the street, it was loaded up fast into a van believed to be stolen. I mean, they were bold. They were really bold. That's the dealership owner who says this is the second time some thieves came after his ATM. After the first time several years ago, he thought he made it tamper-proof. Bolted in, it was cemented, there was rods going inside the stone and everything, that they got it out. You put an ATM to kind of help the, you know, customers to help the general public convenience-wise, but it's not worth it. It won't be going back. It will not be going back, I assure you. That's crazy. Wow. That's what they did? Just crazy, man. It's outrageous, no? Police are not linking this action-packed ATM theft to a recent string of similar cases. Back live and take a good look because tomorrow this space will be bricked over. We do not know exactly how much money was inside that ATM, but we do know that the machine itself cost $2,500. Live in Long Island City, Dave Carlin, CBS2 News. Okay, Dave, thank you.